Now, what the two story problems at the bottom of the page here are asking you to do is identical. In both, they're asking you to find the sales tax rate. To find the sales tax rate, what you're going to do is identify the amount of change. Now, if they give you the new price of the item after the tax, you're going to have to subtract to find the difference. The difference of what the price is with tax versus the price before tax. If they just give you the amount of tax, they've already figured out the amount of change for you. So you're going to take the amount of change and to find the sales tax, you're simply going to divide that by the original price of the item. And that's going to give you, when you do that division, a decimal answer. Sales tax is a rate, as you saw when we talked about simple interest. Rates are percentages, so you want to go ahead and then change that decimal into a percentage. Again, to change a decimal into a percentage, you're going to move the decimal twice to the right and add a percent sign. So if we look at 19, it says the sales tax on a $750 computer at J&M Computers is $48.75. What is the sales tax rate? So they've already found the amount of change because they're telling you that the price is going to increase by $48.75 when it's done. So the price is going to change by $48.75. You're going to divide that by the original cost of the item, which is $750. So I'm going to take $48.75 and divide it by $750, and that's going to help me find my sales tax. Well, when I go ahead and divide that out, the result is 0.065. Well, again, as I said, that's the answer, but it's written as a decimal. Sales tax is always a percentage. So we're going to go ahead and move that decimal twice to the right because that's how we translate to percent. Tack on a percent sign, and that's going to be my answer, 6.5%. Now, question 20 I'm going to leave for you to do on your own, but I am going to help you set up a little bit. It says a hardcover book sells for $24 at the book mart. Ben pays $25.02 for the book. What is the sales tax rate? So they didn't give you outright the amount of change here. And that's what's different about this question from the last question. You have to find the amount of change before you can divide by the original price. Well, if it started at 24 and it went to 2502 with tax, the amount of change is $1.02 because the price went up by $1.02. So here when you're looking for the amount of change in question number 20, that figure is going to be $1.02. Plug in the original price, divide, you change it to a percent, and you'll end up with your sales tax figure.